Mask in Iowa. The app aims to increase accessibility to things like birth control and other medications. Reporter Ruta Olsenida has more on the app that's quickly gaining interest. There's an app for just about anything and everything these days. And now there's an app for this too, contraception. That is cool. Yeah. You can learn about birth control. You can learn about UTI treatment. There's frequently asked questions. And you can also make an appointment at a health center. The Planned Parenthood app has been out for a couple years, but it has just expanded to Nebraska and Iowa last week. The app is called Planned Parenthood Direct. With birth control and everything being delivered to their house, that's amazing since we don't have all of the access that we need in our life for it. For the birth control, it's as easy as answering a couple simple questions right on the app and then getting it delivered straight to your mailbox in just a couple days. There's a feature on the app to even get medication to treat UTIs without visiting the doctor's office. Answer some health questions. Um, there's a $20 visit fee for, um, for this request, and then they would give you a prescription to whichever pharmacy is most convenient for you. The accessibility is a great tool for some women on the go. Yeah, uh, it would help me a lot because I wouldn't have to go and pick it up all the time, um, especially with being in college. You don't really have all that free time that you really want. The release of the app comes just weeks after the organization announced it was not taking in Title X funding anymore, losing millions of dollars in federal funding. The timing is interesting. The, these two things were in the works completely separately, but we really want to continue to make sure that patients can access the care that we provide at Planned Parenthood. The organization wants everyone to know that even without the funding, all services are still offered. The hope now is that the access will only be expanded. There are approximately 210,000 women in the state of Nebraska that currently don't feel like they have adequate access to reproductive health care. Um, so the goal is to really reach those folks. Reporting in Omaha, Rudolf Sinaida, 3 News Now. And it shows every form of Planned Parenthood hopes to add more features to the app in the future. The app is now available to download from the App Store and Google Play.